welcome back for today's Farm and Ranch News. Farmers have lost to the state of California. The U.S. Supreme Court has upheld California's Proposition 12 in a 5-4 ruling. The court dismissed a lawsuit filed by pork farmers against the law on the grounds that they did not state a claim of damages. Proposition 12 makes it a criminal offense and civil violation to sell whole pork meat in California unless the pig it comes from is born to a sow that was housed within 24 square feet of space and in conditions that allow a sow to turn around without touching an enclosure. Prop 12 applies to any uncooked pork sold in the state, regardless of whether it was raised in California. Back in March, we spoke to Terry Walter, then president of the National Pork Producers Council, about the case. It's not only about pork. Pork's the issue of the current case, but really it's about the Dormant Commerce Clause and ultimately how states interact or do business with each other. Uh, in our view, we just feel like uh, the ability for the state of California to regulate industry outside its borders is beyond its jurisdiction. After the court's opinion was released, the National Pork Producer said they were deeply disappointed in the opinion and that they were evaluating it to fully understand all the implications it will have. The pork producers also said they will continue to fight for the nation's pork farmers and American families against what they call misguided regulations. In its argument, the state of California said that its residents choose to pay higher prices so as not to provide a market to products that they viewed as morally objectable and potentially unsafe. Because the law does not attempt to give an unfair advantage to its state's farmers, the state of California contends the provision does not violate the U.S. Constitution. A 2021 Rabobank report said the U.S. pork industry faces a daunting task to comply with the California law, stating that with less than 4% of the U.S. sow housing currently able to meet the new standard, Rabobank expects a shortfall in compliant pork to divide the U.S. market, leaving California with a severe pork deficit and high prices while generating a surplus in the rest of the U.S. market, according to that report.